Yeah, they are. Mm. So Christmas, this is the day after Christmas. We're still recovering. <laughs> no. Yeah. So how was Christmas? It was good. It was actually pretty good. The kids are sick though, so been having to struggle with this one who's sick and doesn't want to acknowledge it. I'm not sick. And then the little ones who are sick, so. The Christmas was awesome. Yes, it was. Kids are definitely spoiled. Yes, they are. So it was, um, Santa was really good to them this year. And, uh, you know, that was a big part of everybody just just helping us out and the kids got what they wanted on their wish lists and and more mm -hmm. and all day long they've just been playing and playing and playing and playing and playing and playing we're a little tired <laughs> yes. Anna hasn't been here she's been with her dad the last couple days so, so Danny and Anna have been spending a lot more time together. So that's good. Definitely good. But Anna's dad leaves tomorrow, which is today already, because it has confused me. Confuse me. <laughs> <laughs> so he leaves on Sunday um, for a couple of weeks. So they're spending Anna's spending time with them and. I told Danny he should stay with us for a week or so at least. Mm -hmm. And I told Daniel that I'll keep a keep an eye on him. Mm -hmm. Make sure he's got food and make sure he's clean and <laughs> Danny, go take a shower. What day is it? Wednesday. Go take a shower. <laughs> How's your pain been? Been pretty bad. It's just, I've been actually trying to help out a little more around the house, so. Anna's gone, so I have to step up, you know, and help Jonathan. Because he's been having pains in your arms. No comment. He's been having pains in his arm. No comment. And feels tingling and numbness in his arm and his leg, and he doesn't want to listen. No comment. Yeah. So, it's just been stressing about that. I'm just worried. I'm fine. That it can lead to something bigger and... Yeah. So, Be Becca was sick this night. Was it Christmas Eve? Christmas, Christmas Eve? Eve. With the fever and then she gave it to Bella. So now Bella has been with the fever. I'm coughing all day yesterday and today. Well, not with the fever yesterday, but today. Pretty bad. Well, yes, it was yesterday because I read the next day. So, I've just been trying to keep her not so hot. Yeah. Just trying to keep it cool. So, we haven't been recording anything because. <laughs> It's been a crazy house. Mm -hmm. Yes, very crazy house. I just want to thank everybody just for making it awesome. I've never had a Christmas like that in my whole life. Mm -hmm. And just to see the kids and how excited they were. And Bella keeps saying, oh my gosh, on everything that she opened. And seeing Xavier when he came down the hall, even though he's almost two, when he saw everything, he just like stopped. He and just, just threw himself on the floor because he didn't know what to expect. He just got so excited and it was just, and he loves everything that he got, you know, tools and cars and... He got to a second toy and he was done. Yeah, he, he just wanted Amalia to open it up and start playing with it right there. And he's like, oh, I'll get the rest later. 
And, and Bella got a lot of clothes and a lot of Barbie dolls, and Becca got a lot of art stuff. So she got, um, Bella got Spongebob pajamas, and... She doesn't want to take them off. She loves Spongebob. She's going to turn into Spongebob. But... So, they were very happy. I guess if they weren't sick, it would have been all better, but because they were are sick, so it just makes it a little more difficult to deal with them. Cause they're cranky. Yeah, so. Yeah. Cause you're cranky too. I'm not cranky. I'm tired. So, yeah. Did you point at me? <laughs> I'm gonna watch that back. <laughs> but we just want to say thank you so much. We're very grateful for everything that you guys have done for us and I know that a lot of people you know got together and helped out and just had our family in your thoughts during Christmas and that, that was, was awesome awesome I, th I, I think me and Jonathan were more excited than the kids <laughs> Christmas morning because at night, it was like two o'clock in the morning and we were just like I think we were, we were more excited than we they were, were. I think we were. I think it was just I love being on this side, you know, and just seeing how excited the kids got and just that was my gift. Mm -hmm. That really was my gift. That just that was it was just awesome and I just kept thinking about what everybody did and they took time out of their day and bought our kids gifts and wrapped them and you know just I, I can't say enough about it and all of them all of them got it even Danny and yeah Anna. Danny Anna Becca like, Bella Xavier all five got, of them everybody got it even gift. Amalia they sent stuff for Amalia you got pajamas she got some pajamas and a bathrobe and a bathrobe and really really nice and some perfume and you got me perfume oh, I got you perfume yeah, he knows that I like uh, Tommy Girl. So that's what I got from, for Christmas. And you got pajamas that you're wearing. I got pajamas. I got Guitar Hero pajamas. Woohoo! <laughs> but we just want to say thank you so much for everything. You know, just the thought, the prayers, and everything that you guys have been providing for us. It's been awesome. So we're getting ready for the next treatment. Mm -hmm. I've been doing good right now with energy, even though at the end I'm worn out, but at least having the energy for the next morning, that's, I think that's all I need. And now that when Anna comes back, so it's going to be a little more help that we would have around the house, so maybe it won't be as stressed. I think that's it. I think that's it. You're stressed because she hasn't been here. Maybe. Kids wear me out. <laughs> Alright, want to call it a night? Mm -hmm. Alright. We got some more cleaning to go do. That's it. That's it. Bye. Bye.